Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Mr. Recapped. Let's get started. In this video, I'm going to recap a thriller movie from 2018, The Killer Nation. But first, I'm going to ask you to subscribe to the channel. Our target is 100 subscribers. I would be grateful for that. There is a lot of blood, death, alcohol, drugs and racism and sexism in the film. From the first minutes of the film we hear the voiceover of the main character who says what the whole town has gone crazy and want to kill four innocent girls. The ending is very unexpected. We are introduced to Lily Coulson who is 17 and her friends Emma, Bex and Sarah. The story begins when Lily arrives at her friend's house and is greeted by Emma Emma's mother, who has been giving a stranger a foot massage. In the room, the girls get together for the party and discuss Emma's mom's new boyfriend and how they'd like to sleep with every football player in school and other 90 talk. Next, we are showing what one of the hackers in the town gets a message from an unknown person with the nickname Herostrat. The message contains unusual pictures of Mayor Butler. The guy sends it out all his friends and and that's where it all starts. Then at the party Lily shows the pictures of the mayor to her friends and they all despise Butler. Next the girls start dancing and each gets what she wants. Emma is hide, Bex is sleeping with the football player and Lily and Sarah are just hanging out. The next morning the news starts discussing the leaked pictures of the mayor and everyone in town treats him negatively. Later the mayor wanted to speak publicly about the scandalous situation, but people start insulting Butler and screaming for him to resign. Unable to stand the embarrassment, Butler pulls out a gun and shots himself in the head. The next day, the school principal and his assistant are discussing the situation with the mayor. Suddenly, his secretary calls him and says what someone leaked all of the personal information and pictures of him. Mass bullying by students begins. They make videos on social networks where they discuss what adult website the principal was on and they shows nude pictures of his young daughter. Over family dinner Lily begins to argue with her parents about all the erotic overtones in the pictures of the principal's daughter and the fact what all loving parents keep pictures of their children. But Lily's mother insults the principal and accuses him of crime and Lily leaves. In the girls room the stranger who liked the pictures of the mayor and principal unexpectedly texts her. The girl finds his IP address and discovers what the stranger is in Moscow. And then the hairstrut connects to her laptop camera and the girl immediately shuts him down. She is threatened. That same evening the school principal speaks to the people, but like the mayor, the people don't want to listen to him. They don't care what the principal says, they just want to put him in jail. Lily invited her boyfriend Mark to the party. They had a toxic relationship. Then they were alone together. Mark yelled at Lily because of the girl's appearance and lecherous behavior. But the quarrel was short-lived. They reconcile and spend the night together. In the morning Lily discovers what half of the town's populations has had their personal information hacked, including Nick Matters, Lily's lover. The girl begins to cry when she sees the new pictures of herself what he sent to Nick. She realizes what she has ruined Nick's family and her relationship. Eternal shame awaits her at school. Of course Mark finds out. He catches up with Lily and along with his friends, grabs the girl, photographs her, humiliated and vows to tell the world what a slutty girl she really is. Lily's mother also finds out about the whole situation and then the girl returns home. Her parents force her to tell the whole truth. The girl confesses and her parents can't stand the shame and kick the girl out of the house. We are then showing Lily walking down the street, but soon two strangers begin chasing her, filming her, threatening her with a knife and forcing her into their car. The girl run into one of the house and then the man run to look for her, but the girl hit him with a shovel. The stranger was drenched in blood, after which she managed to escape 
escape. A week later the town was in turmoil and chaos reigned and people put on mask to find and kill the hacker who had leaked all information about Van and ruined life in the town. The first person they found was Marty Corker, whom they mistook for a hacker. But after a tough interrogation he said it was Lily. The men filmed the whole thing on their phones and then killed him. That night at Amy's house the girls saw a video of Marty blaming Lily for everything, but the girl denied everything. At the same time rebels broke into the girl's house, they grabbed the girls and shot Annie's mother. It turned out what the were policemen among the riders. The girls had no protection, not even from the state. But Amy and Lily managed to escape the chaos, leaving their friends behind. Lily went to her ex-lover, who hid her in his house. Later, Amy is caught and taken to the other girl. Later, he begins to threaten Lily. He thinks she is the one who leaked the citizen personal information. But before he kills her, he decided to sleep with her. He starts kissing her and Lily bites Nick. She runs into the bathroom, where she sees the corpses of the other people Nick killed. The girl closes the door, but what doesn't help? Nick kicks the door open and fight ensues, resulting in Lily slitting his throat with a shaving blade and Nick dying in his own blood. Then Lily goes down to the first floor of the house, where she finds many different tools of Nick's and realizes what she must act. That night a policeman takes the girls to the police station, but Lily blocks his path with a shotgun. She kills the intrepid policeman and lets her friends out. They go to the aid of their friends Bex, who is about to be hanged for her sexual orientation. And in the course of the long gunfight, the girls rescue Bex and get away. Later Lily records a candid video in which she explains to everyone what she wasn't the one who hacked the whole town. And as a result, the other girls believe her and take her side. Next we are showing what the FBI arrested a hacker. It turned out to be a young guy, Lily's brother. And when asked why he did it, he said, I don't know. For the lols. I hope you like the retelling of this strange movie, and it will be even more interesting. Write in the comments what you would like to see in the next recap, and I will say goodbye to you.